What up? What up? What up? You ever have somebody so nosy? They make your skin curl. See, that's what I get for talking about people. I'll come back. Fuck the intro. Jeez. Hello, good folks. Back. Girl, what am I wearing about? Nosy people first. Before I go any further, go ahead and subscribe. Hit that button down low. Hit the bells if you want to get the notifications whenever they come out. <clears throat> So no judgment zone and thumbs up the video comment oh that helps my algorithm algorithm um and my page say hey popular so i am going to go to my car and vlog and uh talk about what i want to talk about anywho nosy people so my neighbor is so freaking nosy she asked me to bring my dog. People. You know, I don't remember COVID until this, until this time to see somebody, right? Shit. I didn't think about this. This is like the worst. Welcome to my life again. Have you missed me? Have you? All I know is. If the vid was after me, I'd have got it. Just in case I see another person on my short walk to vlog in my car. Likely coming. I will be prepared. Good God. That was not even an intermission. That was just straight COVID BS, okay? Gosh. Nobody wears their mask anymore. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> Real cute. Anyway, my neighbor is so nosy that she asked me to bring my dog up and play with her dog. So they have a play date normally with me up there. But this time, I wanted to vlog and I figured vlogging from my car it's a lot easier than like walking with the dog even though I'm walking right now right now so I was like well I'm getting ready to take her in the house unless you want to babysit and she calls me or she says okay in a text and then she calls me and she's like um I'll babysit what do you what do you mean the son vlogging I said I need the son because I want to vlog. Huh? Huh? And you know what I say? All my business is on here, so all you have to do is just like subscribe to my channel and you'll get it all. All the juice. So <laughs> when you click off the video, hey, guess what? You miss all of the gossip and juicy stuff that I think is juicy. She just knows me. And then she had a nerve to say how long you gonna take. Okay, first of all, you said yes. Second of all, I don't know. A lot of shit on my chest. I don't even know where to start. So, I will be trying to set this shit up in my car with very little sun. And I don't even think it matters anymore because none of the sun is on me. It's all behind me. Actually, <laughs> it looks like it's behind me, but it's actually right up there. But yeah, it looks dark to me. I'll see you in a car. Okay, I think we're ready to record from the car. Thumbs up, subscribe. It's gonna be a minute. Let's talk about my hair. <clears throat> I've been thinking about the good times I've been sleeping through the long nights I've been shining in the sunlight I've been thinking how am I 
There's a reason for my feelings There's a reason why I'm healing You're not even really going to get the gist of it until you really see what's going on up here. I have been repairing this hair probably for a year now. <clears throat> know how to do it in everything. Rice water, all the conditioners, figuring out what to make my hair fall out, stress, men, children, regular stuff. But when I say I have lost quite a few locks, it's definitely not like a made up thing. This is why I bought this. These. On my motherfucking locks. Look at that. You know what? I have to wash, condition, oil, just like this hair, okay? Alright? But am I discouraged? Mm -mm. Definitely not. <clears throat> Look at that. See, you can do that. Look at that. See? Yeah, that's on me. Oh, shit. That's me right there. Look at that. It's so full. Mm. Protective smile. Anyway, I have been using some of the oils that's supposed to make your hair grow back, but every time I turn to the side, that's what you see, and that's what you see. It's progress for me because I haven't really recorded it, but it is... It's um, something else to say the least. I've had tracks before. I've had glued in here that made me swell up like a freaking Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I've had it sewn in all of the above. When I say I've lost tracks, I have lost tracks, okay? Never, ever. Have I lost hair like this? <sighs> but keep smiling, keep shining, knowing that. Please take them out. Okay. Um, that was horrible. Basically, my hair has just been falling out from stress, and I already told you all that I've gone to a boy through a boyfriend and a half. It's only a half because. It's a weird space where, you know, I'm that girl that the guy wants, but then don't want, and wants, then don't want. And uh, yeah, like I said, I am completely baffled by men telling me I'm beautiful, I am life changing, I'm positive. I deserve all that I asked for. Parts to be a princess and have someone drive me around and, you know, bring me stuff when I'm not thinking that you will and helping me out, like, you know, basic stuff, you know. There's a list. I will <laughs> do another one for you guys. <laughs> and uh, it's called 11 Ways to Show Your Girl Your Lover. Okay, so I think in lieu of some of the other stressors that's going on, this whole thing has not really gotten better, but I'm still optimistic. So this is what it's usually like. I, girl, I've been really working on my hair. It's really growing. Look at this. I got... That one was probably hanging on by a thread anyway, girl. 
but I have been working on it. I think I got a nice one over here. Where's it? Where it go? Where it go? I got them right here. Oh, maybe not over there. Oh, I got some more over here. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay. Don't worry about the fact that my hair just came out. Okay. I was nothing, but look at how strong and lovely it is. Yes. I go to bed. I wake up. Surprise! Locks on the pillow. <laughs> I know how to crochet, okay? YouTube, okay? So, what I'm gonna do, look at that, I can leave that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna leave it right there. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do my best to like, minimize my stress. I've already started like meditating. Don't hate. <clears throat> and um, stay where you belong. I started meditating more, um, just, you know, finding me as they say, um, been trying to deal with this one and a half breakup, but basically it's all the same. Um, they're either cheaters, liars, thieves, all the above, um, unable to handle me. And because this last one is kind of like, I don't know where, it's kind of like weird where we are, but technically, like, I think if we were like still dating, he would have called me today. Um, but he did do some things around the house for me, which was nice. And then left, asked me about spackling my walls. And I'm just like, you told me that I am a very difficult person to be with and that I make your life miserable. So as I said in my last vlog, I decided to do a list and today's list is going to be all of the things that I am working on that, is that hair? I mean, is that lint? Jeez. All the things I've been working on to improve myself, um, to be the best, best version of myself. Okay. Okay. So that includes doing things for myself, you know what I mean? And really get down to the nitty gritty of my hair. Is this the same one? Anyway, y'all get the point. They, these two right here, they just got to go on with the pack. There we go. I'll use them as a tire. It's like, no. Anyway, when that happens, it's just like I'm outside and I'm just talking to my friend and ooh, camps and it's just like, ah! you know what? This is this is kind of why, you know, I don't really, you know, show people my locks, you know, because it's quite embarrassing. And no, I know you don't judge me, but guess what to be continued on the lockage okay mm -hmm. this is what I have to do because uh, it looks like there's something good going on under there <laughs> something really brewing up be a like nice hairstyle or it's a protective thing so um yeah i'm gonna go ahead and do this so that uh we don't have any more lock casualties <clears throat> okay crap okay there we go so please don't judge me get it girl and i won't judge you look at the cute little bow Game 
Blue is definitely my color. I have chin hair. Yes, I'm going to get back to them, but whatever. Him, them, whatever. But I'm ranting, so I get to say what the... I'm ranting, so I get to say what I want to say. I'm really hot head, and that's one of the things I'm going to work on. So, just buckle on up and have a good attitude today. Ah. Life is something else. So... I feel kind of depressed. I'm not even gonna lie. I feel like it's my fault again. Said it yesterday. Oh my God. Yesterday was a nightmare. Like, I look like one of those patients that escaped from like a place I was supposed to be in. You know what I mean? Cause my lipstick was like half on. I don't know what the hell I was talking about. All I know is I was ranting and I don't have a boyfriend, I don't think, anymore. Look, if you're going to wear it, <laughs> wear it like you mean it. So I tried not to be sad today, but I am really sad. Um, I'm, um, I'm evaluating things. And uh, I said people suck, but I suck. Anyway, I should not be doing this. You see this? Emotions everywhere. Anybody want to come over and eat, eat some pizza with me? <laughs> That'd be great. <laughs> you know, wipe my tears away so I can, like, know my worth. <sighs> and respect my worth. I love too hard. I know that. But I also am a handful. So, like I said, in honor of this, I guess, three year endeavor of trying to be a better person and a better partner, I have somehow failed yet again. And DBSN, Division, whatever you want to call him, he is spot on when he says, I'm no good at love. Who else? There's a lot of people that's not good at love, okay? And I'm kind of sad because I've just been lonely today. And sometimes the people around me, but I still feel lonely. I'm getting things done. But um, I have so much stuff to tell y'all. I don't even know where to begin. Um, I just don't want to. I don't want to hide that this sucks because I feel like I have been working so hard on myself that it should not be this. Hard for people to see me for the good person. Oh, fuck, I suck that I am. So, I'm gonna come back with my list and talk about it because this video is already long enough and I have gone like spiraling into like. <laughs> I'm gonna get my shit together though. I don't want to be alone. Okay? I don't want shit. Okay? I don't want a liar. I don't want a cheater. I wanna feel special. Don't have to be all the time. 
I want somebody who accepts me for me. And I'm gonna tell you, in the next video, all I'm gonna talk about is all the things that I am that probably causes people to leave me. And the other side is supposed to be all the good things and reasons why people wanna stay with me. So coming up, I don't know if it's gonna be today or not um, because this is just all jacked, but it takes a lot for me sometimes to even get out the house. And today I just felt like, why be sorry, sad by myself? And um, yeah, she's watching my dog. She's probably going to learn a big lesson. <laughs> anyway. So, my question that I'm going to end on is what is the bitch meter scale? And by that, I mean if there's a scale of 1 to 10 and 1 being like super passive and just being walked all over, and 10 being the bitch that'll throw the glass, grab the knife out of there. If someone tells you something and they don't do it, how many times are you supposed to let it go before you bring it up? And where on the bitch scale? Yes, I'm saying bitch because it doesn't bother me. Everybody's wrapped up in words. Bitch doesn't bother me. People don't call me a bitch in my face. So, if this is bitch at 10, and this is a rag doll or a puppet, do I wait? I don't know, maybe after the, the day after and say, hey. <laughs> Kind of told me you were going to hang with me or, you know, get together on uh, other days this week. So does that put me at eight? Because I brought it up to seven. Or how about let's have fun and do it the second time to her. Mm -hmm. Promise her some days to, you know, just to treat her like a lady. I'm gonna cheer myself up. So, if I bring it up the second time, does that make my bitchdom come down to five? Because I waited. I am one of the most impatient people I know, especially when it comes to getting things done. And I am working on that because I'm a human being. I am just so curious as to know when someone principally says that they're going to do something, where do you bring it up so you're not here on the bitch meter and you're not here? Where is the happy medium, folks? Is it a reminder on Monday? A reminder on the Wednesday it's coming up? Is it, um, okay, maybe, maybe he just got busy and didn't want to tell me why. I don't know. Maybe forgot. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. <laughs> and then the second week happens and it's the same thing. And then I have a half a boyfriend because I brought it up again. Amongst other things. I don't know if he subscribed to my blog or my page, but like I said, I have started looking at stuff and I am me and I'm gonna stay me. And it's obviously a test to how many close friends I've run away. <laughs> but I appreciate me for being here and I appreciate all the people who are watching me right now, you know, thumbing up and commenting and, you know, 
telling me that life's gonna get bad or it's not gonna be like this every time. history so just want to say to anybody out there that is feeling a little bit down just come look at my video and uh, leave me a comment about how that's going to turn out so yeah the bitch meter where is the scale So you're right around in the middle where assertive is. And not a nagger or whatever you want to call it. Um, and just please answer the question. Like, watch the video. He might watch it. His family might watch it. I don't know. But the shit happened. So, like, niggas be promising you shit that they don't do. And yes, I said it. But I got to censor it out because I might not be able to say it on YouTube. People make a habit of promising things that they just don't follow through with. And they don't do. And if you bring it up, you're the bad guy. Oh, you're going to trip over $20? Yes, I am. I don't care if it's two pennies. If you said... Hey, I'm going to do this. I'm going to give you that 20 back. Don't attack me because I asked for it, okay? First of all, I shouldn't even have to ask, okay? Because I'm going to either feel like you forgot me or you just don't give up. You know what? So, I wrote this list. And I don't think I'm finished, but I'm going to stop because it's depressing me even more. Um, and... I haven't gotten to the side of the good things about me, but to run. Stay tuned. I got to go get my dog, so I'll probably do this another time. Stay tuned for learning what I realize about myself that I'm working on, which makes sense that I'm a mess because, oh my God. I don't even know if I want to be with this person. But hopefully I'll have a nice full page of good things about myself why I should be in a relationship, you know? So, glad you stuck with the video. Um, thanks for watching. And, um, aside from crying, this felt, actually the crying felt good too. It felt really good and, um, it's me. video y'all go look at it yesterday my lipstick oh my gosh <sighs> can't win them all love you guys find out tell me down below what is the meter and what is the time frame please i have my idea of it but you see i'm probably wrong so just please comment down low for the algorithm. I love you guys. Thanks for letting me rant until I come back. I love y'all and I ha la. DC rants, rare and never the same. Sure won't be out. Sorry, I had to do it. As I'm putting on my seatbelt, I get a text that says, your pup sitting by door. What door? What does it mean? I'm on my way. Pup is sitting by door. She probably misses me. Probably could have said it in a better way, but um, yeah gonna be out for the day unless there's something else interesting that I just cannot believe that happens like really she says okay I know it's okay don't ask the baby don't ask the babysit if you can't give me an hour
Come on. So I didn't make pet hotels, okay? And she was just gonna go in the house and chill, but you 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 wanted your lonely dog to play. Anyway, to a dilly.